Who's better known as a loose forward chain in the number five Texas jersey United today. Our vacated it away. It's dangerous for Samoa again. Beautiful pass in. Loosens up to Ilani. The massive the winner. Forwards here, some of the little interpassing, just superb. The skip pass identifying the space, and then came the quick hands. Tuilangi, Tuilangi on the outside, rounded it off. Savia and Halfpenny, and it bounces nicely for Dag. He spins out of a couple of tackles, and he's broken clear. Israel Dag. Now Savia, he's in the clear, Savia, and he's got some support if he can find it. He's still there. Ball pops away for Cruden. All Blacks all getting there now, only 15 or so metres away. Big numbers out to the right, that needs to go. Franks to Reed. they've got to keep it moving. Romano, Nonu, and Smith, and uh, they get the try through Liam Massam. Oh, well done, the All Blacks. They need a determined response here, will they get it? Hook, outside to Hanson, big tackle, but look at this for an opportunity. Morgan inside to Williams. Response for Wales. First the dummy run. Gareth Thomas holds. That's the ball. Shankly and gets the ball. Brilliant, brilliant try. Good hands by Henson. No space, no time. Henson takes and gives the ball. And that creates the try. Ten out from the 22. As Aaron Smith works it away to Retallick. High work rate as always. Aaron Smith again holds it up for Conrad Smith. Quick hands. Savia. Here's Hoare. Gave it back inside. Messam again. Liam Messam. And the All Blacks have the half time lead. Oh, they have done it again, the All Blacks. That's the right play for the Crusaders from Brad Thorne. Drive it up tight. the shots just started to get a little bit lateral then the old Carter inside ball and again Zach Guilford he just zooms into that place it's the killer move of the modern game the inside pass yeah we mentioned about look at that that's a beautiful shot of the no look pass he's he's eyed the defenders hasn't looked where the ball's going takes the hit and puts Guilford through the hole that's just genius genius for our camera work there it shows how as a defender it's so difficult to defend. And Owen Franks, the props in at the heart of things. Oh, and a little look by Pity Whipper, and there are the support lines again. Wonderful work by Crockett. He didn't even have to look, did he? There's McCall. Oh, oh beautiful, beautiful play. That is simply glorious as the All Blacks take it in once again, and this time it's Corey Jane who gets it. Throws, throws a break, throws the pass, he knows support is going to be there. Number one, he doesn't know the pass is on. One, two, great skills, give and take, winger comes in. Brilliant try. What great finishing. Basic skills at its best. Fantastic. Cow. Nice hands from Thorne. Basting the first tackle. Got to retain his feet. Manages to do so for a while. Good run by Brad Thorne. They're right on the 22 as Reed hands it off to Smith. Now Carter. They have got numbers here. Nonu. Draw and pass. Donnelly. And the long pass goes across and Tony Woodcock. A loose head prop on the wing, and the All Blacks... ...who busts the initial tack the, uh, tackle. Here's the end of it. Everybody just does the right job. Draw pass, draw pass. Franks is there as well as an extra man, but it's Woodcock who gets the final pass from Donnelly, who executed that well, and canters in with the big dive. Well, Ben Franks might claim that the little dummy run he made drew the last of the defence. But Tony Woodcock is mate going, going over the try. Brilliant little touch in the middle of all that. Wood. Fuamana Sapolo feeds the ball in. Terrific hands to Robinson. Fuamana Sapolo. That was quite brilliant. No New Zealand attack with Nonu. 
In goes Whippu. And New Zealand showing great hands there. Smith, beautiful. Inside then out. And it's our oh, well, Did you see all of this? England can't slow them down. When New Zealand get quick ball, they're deadly. They haven't got enough. This ball is consummate.